On my way back to my room, I saw flyers posted on every wall asking for help to find a missing girl named Kristen Chambers. According to the flyer, she was a student at the university who had been missing for a month now. I didn't know the girl, but seeing that she was missing and that there was a possibility that she could be dead was terrifying. She was a pretty biracial girl who looked like me. We were almost the same height and weight. The flyer said that she was last seen when she left campus to go to a 7-Eleven store. Reading this melted my heart away. I knew her family must be going through it. That's sad, huh? Said a voice from out of nowhere. I turned around and saw a black girl standing behind me. I swear I had no idea where she came from. Yes, it is, I replied. Do you know her? I stepped back so I could stand next to her. No, I didn't know her. But whoever did this to her, I hope they pay for it dearly. While she expressed her feelings about the situation, I looked at her from head to toe. She was a very petite, average-looking girl who couldn't have been older than 19. She wore a simple ponytail, sweatshirt, and a pair of blue denim jeans. She looked just like a college kid. What's your name? I asked her. Penny. Penny Nelson, she replied, and then she held out her hand. 